Okay. New day. We have eight star chips. We still got a Millennium Pendant. We're looking good. But uh, I think there's not too many lesser trainers. We're going to be facing the better ones now, which means it's going to be tough. But we can get to 10 star chips, and we can get to the finals. And we have to. You know what? Let's take a look at our deck. Alright, so in our first deck, we do have a lot of cards that maybe could come out to be replaced with something else. We've got the Winged Dragons, they may be not as strong as the Blackland Fires, Aquamador Battlelocks, Swordsmen. Now there's a lot of cards that aren't dragons, that aren't boosting, and there's some spellcasters we may not actually need. So, maybe we should start switching some things out to boost up our main Dark Paladin. The Drac Brachioratus, not really helpful. Maybe somebody wants to do some trades. But, um, yeah, I think we're looking pretty strong on this deck so far. But I think we can push it. Let's go check our Cyber Dragon deck. Now we're checking our Cyber Dragon deck. Obviously, we got the two Cyber Dragons. We got Cyber Jar, Cyber Archfeed, Seven Completed, Cyber Network, Cyber Summon Blaster, and Cyber Twin Dragon. Now, we're going to push some more Cyber cards in there. Hopefully, if we can get some off the Keeper of Cards. But this is probably going to be a machine deck, maybe, instead. Who knows? We'll see. You know, this thing is basically Summon Skull. But Cyber. And maybe not as powerful. But when, when you look at it, that's what I think. So, um, yeah, I think that's what we want to try and do here. We want to try and build another deck. Which, I don't know if we'll use it and we'll be prepared for Duelist Kingdom. But it does need some practice. But with our main deck, you know, it's definitely possible. We can win this thing. I'm pretty happy with all the cards that we've got. Well, I guess we should uh, go check out the Keeper of Cards and see what he's got for us. Okay, let's head to the Keeper of Cards. We want to keep up building that deck if we can. Alright, so I think he's this way. I wonder who's going to be gathered around. I know, uh... Oh, we could... I don't know. Would it be weird crossing the field? I feel like it would be weird. Now we want to grab the Keeper of Cards. Hopefully we can find a duelist to battle. Maybe one that we haven't seen around yet. I know Keith and all these guys are doing pretty well. Alright, let's let's go check out the Keeper of Cards. Hey man. Okay. Cyber Cards. Machines. What do you got for me? Cyber Dragon's Way? Okay. I like the look of that. Cyber Repair Plan? Alright, definitely useful in the deck so far. Cyber Dragon Core. I like its effect. You know, people might mis misjudge this monster, so I like that. And Cyber Dragon Dre. I also very much like that one. We needed another, you know, four star strong dragon cyber monster. So, alright, I'll take them all. We need to build this deck, and you've got the best cards around. Or at least for me. I guess you like cyber cards too, huh? Well, yeah. I want them all. I'll take them all. Thanks, Keeper of Cards. Alright, so we got the Cyber Dragon. We got four more cards. That makes 12 to the deck. You know, we're gonna have to keep getting more. And then soon, we can battle at this stage. And man, will it be epic. I don't want to walk on this stage, but... Whew, we're gonna be battling the, the quarters, the semis, the finals, the whole thing. We'll be right here, and it'll be pretty intense, I'm sure. Alright, let's see who we can find to battle. He's hey, outside. hey you! Me? Yeah, you. I haven't seen you on the island before. Yeah, I kind of was late. Well, I'm kind of looking for a duel. You are? I think you're up for a duel? For sure, how many star chips do you have? I have eight. What about you? Um, two. Oh, uh, I... are you willing to put two on the line? Yeah, I guess. I mean, time's running out. Finals are starting soon. That is true. So what sort of deck yeah. are you running? Uh, you don't need to worry about that. You'll find out in the ring. Oh, fine. I thought it'd be a little bit cheeky. Yeah, so, uh, what arena do you want to go to? Be a mountain arena. Yeah, sure. Let's do that. One. Yeah, yeah, that sounds good. 
And I guess we should probably look for one. Wait, you don't know where it is? I mean, like, it's somewhere around here. I left the map in my room. Great. So, you know. Where'd the helicopter go? Oh, I saw that too. Hmm. Do you know who that was with that Kaiba? No, it was, uh, some guy with some dinosaur cards. His name was Zylo. Guy with dinosaur cards. I'm yeah. I'm excited for that fight. He, he's the one who took my stars. Oh, dude. So he's good then. Yeah, he lucked out. Managed to destroy my mirror force before I could use it. Oh, okay. I'll keep that in mind when I when I come face to face with him. But you said you were looking for some ocean dude, right? Yeah. Why yeah. do you ask? I know where you can find him. And really? uh, if you beat me, I'll tell you. Perfect, because if I beat you, I'm still gonna need a, about six more starships. Yeah, no, he's um, he's an interesting character. Yeah, I'll bet. But uh, if, if you really want him, he's all yours. I'll, I'll point you in the right direction if you can beat me. Sounds like a plan. If First, not, we're gonna have well, to find this mountain arena. Yeah, I think it's like up on a hill somewhere. Not a hundred percent sure. Looks huh. like we found it. Yeah. Guess there really was one on the mountain. That was a bit of a hike. I'm not gonna yeah. lie. Yeah. Definitely not worth it. Can't wait to use the one that's inside the castle. Oh yeah, that why can't we just use that one for every duel? I Make have no idea. Lives easier. Oh yeah. Anyways, so two star chips, right? Two star chips. And the information about that ocean dude. It's all yours. Alright. Sounds like a plan. Let's do this. Excited. Yeah, me too. It's time to do -do 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 duel. Alright, I'll let you go first. Alright, let's do this. I'm gonna start by putting one card in face down defense mode, and that's it. Alright. Well, I'm gonna start by setting one card face down. And one more to follow. I'm gonna end my turn. Alright. I guess I'll just copy your move. And pass. Alright, well... I am going... to tribute to summon my monster to bring up my Dark Magician Girl. Dark Magician Girl. I'm gonna start the battle phase, destroying the monster on the right. Fine by me. Your master. Kill my mass dragon. <laughs> This effect lets me bring out another dragon from my deck. I think I'll bring out another mass dragon. Fair enough, fair enough, okay. It's your turn. Hmm. Perfect. I activate mountain. It raises the power of all my dragons by 300. Yep, that is a, a, good, a good move. A nice field cut. And I think I'll play one more card face down and end my turn. Okay. I'm gonna set one card face down. I'll move into the battle phase to destroy another mass dragon of yours. And end my turn. Don't like you oh, stacking up the mass dragon there. goes. Another one follows. Alright, I'll end my turn there. Perfectly fine with me. I'm gonna sacrifice my Witch of the Black Forest to summon the Summon Skull. No, then I'm her gonna ability activate activates. Spellbinding Circle on your Summon Skull. Great. That still doesn't stop me from pulling a monster from my deck for That's Witch fine. of the Black Forest. But that summon skull is a powerful monster, and I don't want it attacking my dark magician gill. I'm gonna grab this new card that I got. Fair. That's fair. I guess I have to end my turn. With that draw, I'm gonna tribute summon Time Wizard and Dark Magician Gill to bring out the Dark Magician of Chaos. With that powerful monster, I can destroy your final mass dragon. I'll let it slide. I'll end my turn there. 
removed from play. That magician of chaos, his ability banishes the monsters it destroys. Ah, uh, can't have that. You're gonna have to do something about it. Hmm. Guess I'm gonna set another card and end my turn. Okay. Guess with that, I'm gonna so normal summon the Neo the Magic Swordsman. Now I'm gonna destroy your summon skull. Get him out of there. Fine. I'll take the damage. Now, where's my Neo the Magic Swordsman to destroy your face down monster? <sighs> Not my chick. Red Eyes B chick. Great pick. And I'll end my phase there. Hmm. I don't like where this is going. I'll set another monster. That's it. Okay. I'm gonna set one card face down. And move into the battle phase. I'm gonna pick up one more with Dark Magician of Chaos, his dark magic attack. Activate Grave Robber. Let's me take a card from your graveyard. Ooh. I'll use my spellbinding circle on your Magician of Chaos. Alright. Smart move. I like that. I'm gonna destroy your face down monster. I'll end my face. Me. Carbon Geddon thrives in the graveyard. Fact. I'll use this ability right now. By removing him from play, I can summon a level 7 or lower dragon type monster from my deck or hand to the field. That lets me bring out Good my red eyes black dragon in defense mode. Ooh. I guess I'm lucky it's in defense mode. For now. Next up, I'll summon Luster Dragon in attack mode. And I'll move my way to the battle phase and have him attack your Neo, the Magic Swordsman. Okay, that's fair enough. I guess I'll end my turn there. to reborn. What? Simple enough. I'm gonna bring back my Dark mm. Magician Gale. Great. In attack position. But, since I need to deal with that Luster Dragon, I'm gonna tribute summon it to bring out my Dark Magician. Now you're in for it. Now Magician, destroy your Luster Dragon. <sighs> Fine. I, I would've taken face. out my Red Eyes though. That would have been a good play. I'm sorry that to have to do have been this a good to play. you. Do what? Activate Giant Trunade, returning all of our cards to our hand. I'll then reactivate my Mountain card. Well, now the Spellbinding Circle is gone. No matter. This duel's already over. Dragon old. Ragnarok. And Dragon's activate Dragon's Mirror. Mirror to bring up my five-headed dragon. Wow. Okay. Now, destroy his magician of chaos. That, that is a strong monster right there. Sorry to end that way. Okay. I'll take the loss. The two star chips are yours. I did not see that one coming, and I thought I had the upper hand. Yeah, you thought wrong. The duel is yours. Oh man. Oh, damn. That was a good match. Yeah, that um a five headed dragon is power. Yeah, it's my strongest card as of right now. So there you go. Two star chips. You awesome. end them. Yeah. It's like uh I've gotta be fighting as hard as I can to get to the finals now. Me too. I was At least I have a run. shot now. Yeah, he is. Good luck charm or something. Oh, what mean. is that? Um, it's called the Millennium Grimoire. I, it's just a book that kind of showed up in my room. It's kind of fancy. I have, I have something similar. It's the Millennium Pendant. What? It wasn't always the Millennium Pendant, though. It used to be an what insignia, do you mean? and then I woke up one day and I had this. Like, it was switched or something. I don't know. It's weird. That is weird. 
I haven't when did you get it? So I've, I've had it since my grandpa gave it to me. He said to always keep it safe. It's a good luck charm. But weird, because I just found this here. And I guess it's your good luck charm. I guess so. I don't know. Like I, I lost against that Xylo guy right after I threw it out. Exactly. So. Maybe you would have won. I don't know. I mean, I don't want to blame it on that, obviously, but who knows? I guess keeping it around couldn't hurt. I mean, all I know is they're a little bit confusing, and Pegasus has one. Wait, Pegasus has one? Pegasus has one. What? What is it? It's his eye. I don't know what it does, but his eye is a Millennium Item. Millennium Item? Is that what these things are? Yeah, that's what they... I mean, everyone I've seen has been called Millennium something. So that's, I guess, what I've been calling them. Huh. This other Weird. guy, Bakura, has one that I, I saw on the island, but I never battled him. Oh, Strange. Well, let's I don't get a duck. This thing does. But yeah, you're right. We should probably get back to the castle. I do owe you something, though. The guy you're looking for. You'll find him at oh, the yeah. Ocean Arena. Like, the one down there, or... The one oh, that's, that's more beach, closer to the ocean. That's more of a beach arena. All right. I'll show you the way at some point. But I, yeah, this guy's good. a little bit kind of crazy, I guess. He's an interesting character. You can probably guess what kind of deck he runs. Yeah, I'm assuming creatures of the sea. Right on the door. But uh, anyway, you earned that information. And I hope I see you in the finals. I'd like a yeah. second chance. Agreed. Let's head back. It's getting late. Oh, man, it's late. We lost two star chips today. That's our first loss. It's rough. But we'll come back stronger. We will make it to the finals. Next duel, I'm gonna go all out. It's exactly what I'm gonna do. Everything on the line not giving up. I will get all four star chips from somebody, and I will eliminate them. No questions asked. You know, my grandfather gave me this Millennium Pendant. Well, he gave me the Millennium Insignia. For some reason, I've got this pendant. I don't know exactly why or what it does. He just told me to always believe in the heart of the cards and I would never lose and in that duel I didn't believe in the heart of the cards I was cocky I thought I had it and then 10 seconds later the five headed dragon comes out and annihilates my monsters <sighs> today I failed you grandfather but tomorrow I will succeed I'll believe in my cards, and I will win this entire tournament for you. The Millennium Pendant, it may not be the Insignia, but I believe it has the same effect. So Grandfather, I hope you believe in me, as I believe in my cards. And I will win this tournament, and Pegasus will be stopped with his mind games. Another guy with a random Millennium Pendant found? It's not a coincidence. Yugi's here, Bakura's here, he's here with his Millennium Pendant, they're all together. There has to be something going on. And that's one more thing that I will try and get to the bottom of. But winning, and defeating Pegasus, is my main goal.